welcome back to my channel and in today's vlog we are going to Dubai we made it to The Wi-Fi could have been better. Yeah, Wi-Fi could have been better. Well, I wasn't really using it. I was watching TV. But it was really good. It was actually really smooth. It had some turbulence, but not even as bad as yeah. I remember it was smooth. Actually, it was like, I was like, whoa. Yeah, it was, but it wasn't bad. Yeah. It didn't last that long. Yeah. Smooth land. Mm -hmm. Very good service. The pool was okay. It was, it was decent. It was, it was mid. Decent. I, but I didn't expect much of it, so my time Yeah, yeah. Really low, Airplane, so. Airplane food was never good. Yeah. So yeah, you guys, the flight was 14 hours in total from Miami to Dubai. And they did provide, I wanna say three meals or two meals. They gave us a dinner, a lunch and a breakfast. And for our hotel stay, we stayed at the JB Marriott Hotel in Dubai. It was very nice. Like I had this room to myself, so it had two beds, a bathtub, a shower, uh, two toilets. It was really nice, okay? And then, um, oh, actually, no, one of them was a toilet, the other one was a bidet. Yeah, the bidet. You know, they have that in, in them other countries. And then um, you have the view. The view is so nice. And views from my hotel room was so immaculate. You're gonna see it shortly. Um, and our hotel had like restaurants in it. It had a whole club in it. Like everything in Dubai. Dubai is probably the best trips I ever took. Like if you're looking for a luxury, just, you know, vacation, Dubai is the spot. I'm telling you this right now. Like we had restaurants in our hotel. We had stores in the hotel. We had uh, clubs in our hotel. Like. And people were so nice there too. Like they showed us like the moves in the area. Like, and I, I didn't feel at all like in danger in Dubai. Like it was just nice vibes. Just, it was great. Yeah, and I didn't pay for one drink when I was out there. Like <laughs> me and my friends, we had a great time. I'm sorry. And so this is the next day and our hotel literally had a buffet breakfast okay like this is just a section of buffet breakfast they have fresh fruit they had donuts they had cereal they had chefs making omelets and you know whatever you wanted for you like okay like dubai does everything big okay <laughs> And the first destination we headed to was Cove Beach in Dubai. So it was a beach day um, and we had little cabanas and it was just see an upcoming clips of, you know, what's looking like. But it was really nice, really relaxing. I heard everything in Dubai is man-made. So I was kind of shocked to see like a man-made beach, like how y'all do that. But it was it was very nice. Like they, we had like little restaurants inside the the beach too. The only thing I would say is that in Dubai, like they have strict rules against liquor, so you cannot bring your own liquor into the beach. And here are some clips to a private show that we had in the business bay area of Dubai. Um, and this place was just really nice, and you just see the dancers and some of the clips from the show. Lots of like places where you could sit. Um, the beach was nice. Um, they had a bar. The only thing with Dubai, there's a lot of rules in Dubai, okay? But they said that you know you go to jail for twerking. I'm not surprised because you can't even drink alcohol at certain places, even at the beach. I mean, I don't think most beaches allow you to drink alcohol. 
I don't know. But yeah, even at the beach, like, you couldn't bring alcohol in there. They had alcohol for us in there. So I guess that's, you know, better than, you know, nothing. And what can I do about you? I'm spending money, okay? Like, don't think this is some Costa Rica, you know, cheap trip. No, you spend money. I don't want to say it's that much money more than, like, American food. Just imagine you're eating at, let me see, what's these pieces of things? I don't know anymore. Like, I would say, like, a little more than Cheesecake Factory every day. So it's not horrible, it's not like, oh my god, I can't even eat, you know, you, you're gonna find something to eat. It's just that you just gonna have snacks and anything bread. And you guys, we did a little bit of sightseeing. This is the Dubai frame. We also went to the gold souk market. So if you're looking for gold, like I heard gold is cheap in Dubai. So yeah, that's the place to go if you're trying to find some gold. Um, and yeah, so here's some clips from our sightseeing in Dubai. Hola. We're in the market. In the market. <laughs> So yeah, you guys, this market was basically like, if you ever been to like the swap shop or a flea market, like that's the style, like you gotta know how to negotiate. Cause you know, if you're a tourist, they might scam you. So you gotta make sure you know how to talk. And they had like all, oh, a lot of different options. You could buy candy, seasoning, spices, uh, perfume, uh, gold. Like that was a great market to go to if you're looking for stuff to buy. And for dinner, we went to Dinner in the Sky. Um, it's one of the biggest tourist attractions in Dubai. And yeah, it was pretty nice. The views were like breathtaking. And we got there at sunset, which I feel like was probably the best time to go because we saw daylight, we saw sunset, and we saw nighttime. So I would say doing it around 5 30, 6 30, that's the best time to do your reservation. This dinner was $200, a whopping $200, but it was worth it. The experiences are unlike any other. And the marina is right behind the Dubai Marina Mall, of course. And then the scenery of this yacht party, y'all. Y'all, like, there's no other like it. Like, Miami is a good second. But it was just so beautiful to see the night lights and the buildings. And ugh. yeah. I can see why they say yacht in Dubai, cause what? Okay, this is not no ferry, baby. This is a yacht. Okay, this is about yacht. I have this clip because for some reason the roof of this thing, this bridge was so low, like we almost died. But <laughs> I'm just joking, joking. I'm joking about it. But yeah. And so now we're on to the next day and this is the day we went on the safari tour in the desert and i'm telling you this is one of the most fun days like this tour had a lot of things like you could eat tv you could camera ride they had a buffet dinner and a show like i recommend this tour to anyone you know visiting dubai like and with the atvs it was just so crazy because like the man kept saying come back come back and we were just on the atv the whole time which is which is not nice but 
<laughs> but I had the time of my life, okay? And the desert is just such a different scenery. It was really nice. the head driver okay and this job was just so crazy i'm really out here risking my life like <laughs> but he got it he got it so in this part we were doing the light show and the camel rides so baby these people have real fire okay like And the light show also came with a buffet and basically an all you could eat just array of foods. I didn't get a video of it, but the food's good. Like I wanna say it was like the best food in the world, but I you know, I, I could eat it. Like they had this good chicken. Ooh, the chicken was so good, yeah. And the next day, it was our trip to Abu Dhabi. I wanna say it was an hour away from Dubai. And this is where we went to the mosque and stuff. And there was a bunch of different malls to go to. We're, we had this one mall on the way. And then also where the mosque is, there is a mall in there as well. And I used this mall to buy my uh, scarf because you had to come covered. Of course, like nothing showing. Even I got in trouble. <clears throat> Cause I'm tall and my ankles are showing, so they made me buy a whole different pant and uh, dress to go underneath my hijab to make sure like none of my ankles and none of my arms are showing. Which kind of made my hijab because it was see through. It was it. It wasn't cute, so I didn't take no pictures. But um, it was really nice. Like the hijab, the buildings look really nice. Okay, like yeah. So. It was also very hot, like, I was steaming. But this is one of those places you always see when people go to Dubai on Instagram. And that night we headed to the Emirates Financial Towers. There was actually a couple, like, nightlife spots in this building. Um, I know we went to Kiza, which is like a nightclub, and they had like a couple other nightclubs on different floors. So if you're looking for, you know, basically places with African food and nightclubs, this is the spot, okay? Like they had a couple options, so. It was also our last day in Dubai, so we did a quick trip to the Dubai Mall, and we went to see the burj khalifa which is the tallest building in the world okay in the world like this building is really really tall and they have like a fountain show next to the mall and you can see the building at the same time it was just so nice like i'm sorry for using that word a lot but maybe like dubai just nice like luxury luxurious all of that i can see why people love it here because i want to go back <laughs> And with me, like, you know, certain places, you know, I'll, I'll go back in a couple of years, but if somebody told me next year, let's go to Dubai, I'm like, oh, I'm down, like, let's go. Like, there were some places we didn't go to, like the Miracle Garden, things like that. Like, I should have planned a little bit better to go to those places, but for sure, anybody trying to go to Dubai next year, hit me, hit my, hit my line, we going, we going, like, 
what this is the place but anyways so this is probably the end of the video and i want to thank you guys for watching the video and please subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already like the video comment tell me what was your favorite part of this trip y'all and this trip actually having back in october but i was in my six month break era because i was trying to figure out what i wanted to do and i needed to get a new job and i wanted to get a job in tech so but yeah i have a new job now so we're talking trips on trips on trips on trips okay so be sure to subscribe and i'll see y'all on the next video bye